my name is Jeff Tisalu. I am a PhD student in ecology and evolutionary biology, researching the evolution of systems of social behaviors in humans and uh, in other species as well. Specifically, I am interested in using mathematical models to uh, better understand when people make the strategic decision to communicate with their groups. Um, for instance, a lot of people don't like public communication. A lot of people don't like speaking in front of groups. Uh, you put them in front of a handful of people, especially people they're familiar with, and they're, they're totally fine. But you put them in front of 20, 30 people, 50 people, and it's, it's a whole different story. Uh, so clearly, there is an element of risk associated with speaking in front of groups, with, with engaging with a group. Uh, in, in, in our case, I think that risk is just a fear of looking ridiculous. But uh, more broadly, I think it's just a, a, a sort of a concern about one's social standing and how performance might affect one's social standing. Um, the interesting thing is that it's not entirely linear. Most people are far more afraid of speaking in front of a, a, a group of hundreds than they are a, of speaking in front of a group of, of 10, you know, dozens of times in a row. So uh, our assessment of the, the potential risks, the potential costs of engagement scale much more quickly than our assessment of the, the potential gains. And I think once you, you, you get that, you start to see very large groups associated with disproportionately high risks, and you, you get stage fright and uh, butterflies in your stomach. Um, specifically, what I am interested in doing here is using math models as sort of a simulation of human behavior, and specifically of, of the sort of decision-making criteria that we use when deciding whether or not to communicate. So the first big decision is whether to do it at all. And if you don't, then you just walk away. But if you do, you have to decide how much of yourself you really want to commit to it. You could um, commit a lot of energy. You could be really big, really loud, really noticeable. Um, everyone sees you. Everyone judges you. Uh, or you could commit far less energy and kind of whisper it, make sure some people see you, but maybe manage expectations. Maybe other people over there don't see you. And risk is, uh, risk is minimized. And even when we're not aware of doing this, there is a, a, an unconscious strategic level to these decisions. And mathematical modeling is very well suited to capturing that, um, sort of converting it into a, a standard system, and then allowing us to apply it across social contexts and even across entire species. Uh, ultimately, I think this is really important work because it helps us to understand and situate our behavior in, in a broader context across species. And, I think that informs our understanding of ourselves in isolation as well.